I believe parents want to be connected to the school. You just have to go out and reach them. You have to go and, and meet them at the time that they're available, and you have to make an effort. And so I felt like then I'm going to put a focus and an emphasis on bringing our parents into the fold. When you see it in their eyes and you see that gleam in their eyes and sometimes the tears in their eyes because they're being included, then you know you're doing the right thing and you know it's, it's a powerful thing because that way you're going to have sustainability. You shouldn't be afraid of your parents or your stakeholders. One person can't do it, one team can't do it, one cabinet can't do it, one principal group. It takes everybody and most importantly the parents because it's their kids that are being uh, educated here. Well, if you wanted to um, begin your own You're the Parent initiative, you need to go out and meet your parents. Uh, number two, you need to help, you need to begin to uh, put together those groups of parents at each school site to be uh, sort of your, your liaison uh, to your office. And then you're not bypassing the principal, the principal's involved. And then the third thing is to make sure to involve them in the decisions that affect them and their child. And, and be really honest about that. Sometimes we as administrators, we're like, oh, we know it all, we went to school for it, and we have the doctor this and doctor that. But it's still their kid, it's their child, it's their student, it's our student. But you know, you have to remember that that's the most precious, important thing to them. And so we have to kind of like teach the parents about the importance of planning for the future because it is not culturally something that they think about. They think about the present because they're, they're, most of our parents are migrant workers. They live day to day. One of the things that you do as a principal is you look at the culture. And, and one of the things that was lacking was parent involvement for whatever reason. They didn't feel welcomed. Uh, and maybe it wasn't something that was done intentionally, but they didn't feel that they were part of the school. My job is now to bring those parents back. The positive changes in, in, in their education has dramatically changed having this initiative. I wish that every child in this great country had the same opportunity that our students have here. And for them to have these tools, to be able to utilize them, to make a, get a better education and make a better life for themselves, makes a big difference. And, and having an administration in our school district that has a parent as a teacher, as a worker, as an employee, as somebody from the community, even a student. They have an open door policy where you have a concern, they'll listen to you. They're not closed minded and that's something that really that I feel has made a big difference in making sure that our initiative has taken off to where it's at now. I, as a teacher in the classroom, I feel that the education of our students is just like a little mini table with three little legs. One, the student, the parents, and the school. So if that little table is missing one little leg, then it's not going to work. So as a teacher liaison, I need to bring parents in. That's my job. That's my role. What are the positive things of having technology in the classroom? A lot of the parents just understood that their students were going to get tablets, but they didn't know what they were going to do. So now what we're doing with the program, uh, our parent group of Inc., which is Parents as Partners Incorporated, uh, we are trying to train parents in technology. And we are training them in their language. Because if, you, if we do not train them in their language, then we are not going to have parents here. Lo que me ha gustado es que antes de este año ella no sabía leer. What I like is that before this year, I did not know how to read. On the iPad, um, what I learned is that I, I learned how to read and I learned how to count.